Hello, everybody. My name is Monica Kretschmer. I'm the founder and CEO of Canadian Business Chicks and Women of Inspiration. And it is my greatest pleasure to be rocking it out with our 2017 Women of Inspiration who are inspiring others to greatness and creating a rippling effect that's long lasting um, by the work that they're doing in the community and around the globe. And I have the opportunity to be interviewing uh, this afternoon uh, Patty McLeod. She is the corporate director and board chair of the Calgary Co-op. So welcome, Patty. Thank and you. you've been nominated as a woman of inspiration. So please share. How does it feel to be nominated as a woman of inspiration? Oh my, well, obviously it's a great honor and, um, and I, and I deeply appreciate it. Um, I see these, uh, types of nominations and this type of opportunity really more as a chance to, for those that nominate you to actually say what you're doing is important to them. And it's never a checkbox at the end of a story. It's more of an opportunity to say, you know, you're a taller, brighter lighthouse and keep doing what you're doing. So uh, that it, it means a lot to me and it inspires me to keep going and keep contributing to my community. Very, very well said lighthouse. <laughs> I, uh, you know, you're obviously doing something right, uh, Patty. So if you can just share with us, um, you know, some of those traits that have led you down the road to success and led people to the, you know, to to nominate you as a woman that is inspiring those around them? Oh, uh, well, it's interesting because we all have our own definitions of whether we've been successful. Uh, you know, I think my journey has been one of uh, tenacity, uh, putting my hand up when uh, it may have not seemed uh, the time to do so. Uh, resilience, getting back up um, many, many times. Uh, doing things a little bit differently than I'm a lawyer by profession and, and my, my path has not been a traditional one. Uh, definitely champions who take a chance, take a chance on me and, and have given some things to do. And then finally, I think it's just hard work. Blood, sweat and tears. Blood, sweat and tears. And I call it education and effort. It's, you know, you have to, you have to have the right background, but at the end of the day, you got to put your hand up and go try different things. Well said, Miss Patty. And what about recognition? Um, you know, it's it's one of those things that we don't we we don't we're not comfortable in that spotlight, but yet it's so important. Why is recognition um, on platforms such as Women of Inspiration or mentorship programs um, that we're building with Canadian Business Chicks, where you're recognizing the efforts of others? Um, why is it so important for our growth? Oh, you know, I think it does a couple of things. One, um, like I said earlier, it tells, it tells the person who receives that recognition that they're doing something that other people value and has, um, has impact. And, and I think without recognition, sometimes you can toil away and not know that you're, you're making any difference. Uh, personal thanks are always nice, but there's, there's no doubt a platform. I also think women, you know, we're kind of tough on ourselves and we're tough on each other. And uh, I subscribed to this for a long time, this, this uh, I think, typical model where self-promotion was not something that, you know, we valued or, or we saw as being appropriate. And uh, I think you just have to get to a place where you're more comfortable recognizing your own efforts, but also recognizing others. And the platform you're creating allows us to do this for each other. Awesome. But it's not easy to find ways to help someone else all the time. So, Well, we look forward to officially welcoming you to the nest and <laughs> we have an amazing mentorship program who, you know, and, and a lot of those key traits for the lots of, for the women, actually one of them is mentorship. Yes. Be of service to others. Right. Everybody had blood, sweat and tears on the list, you know? Um, so yeah, it's really exciting. And I really, once again, would like to congratulate you on doing the extraordinary work that you're doing, trailblazing, um, leading by example, and inspiring others to be more and do more. And we look forward to celebrating um, you, Patty, at, on September 30th at the Calgary Talus Convention Center. And uh, for those of you that are watching this video, this quick little rapid fire, I'd love you to learn more about Patty and her work. Um, head to CanadianBusinessChicks.com, scroll on to Women of Inspiration, and you can visit our nominees, click on to Patty and read her bio and find out more of the exceptional work that she's doing in the community and around the globe, and uh, run, 
don't walk to get those tickets to join us because it is Canada's largest inspirational and empowerment event. And we're going to blow the lid off the TELUS Convention Center. We're going to party like it's 1999. We're going to celebrate with some keynote speakers and yeah, that we're going to, we're going to make an impact together because together yeah. we are stronger. So thank you so much, Patty, for your time. And I look forward to celebrating with you thank on you. Saturday, um, September 30th. I'm making a playlist. I just got to say. I just think that's, that's a great idea. Yes. Great we're all getting a playlist and then we're going to do some kar karaoke carpool. <laughs> Ready? Like Gabby. She's just a girl and she's on fire. You're on fire, Patty. Bye. Dance. <laughs> Don't make me do this alone. Um, 